feel ugly after dealing with you. You know what I'm talking about. A lot of people, you know what I'm talking about, was stifling your fortune. They were trying to stifle the rest of your fortune. These people saw your potential and your greatness. These are people that you may not even thought was into spirituality, but they were looking into people's fortune. They were looking whether or not you're a star. Like they were studying you, they had you. You didn't even know that these people even was like looking into the spirituality stuff. You didn't have no recollection of that, but these are the people that was trying to stifle the rest of your fortune. So be on the lookout, yo. I'm telling you right now, these people will try to play dumb. These people will try to play uh, small. These people will try to play like they don't know, they're unaware, but these are the very same people, okay? All right? So, <clears throat> like, and they were looking into your fortune, whether or not, and they were trying to find out if you're a star. I'm telling you. And they had, like, they had you in third party situations. They put you in third party situations with other people because they had groups of people studying you. They had groups of people trying to siphon your energy. There were people in like, I would say a larger group that saw you. And this, well, there was multiple groups of party that was associating your name based off of what somebody did that you did not view as spiritual though. because they knew you it was always about you and your capacity to embody god to embody the light thus it making you a magnetic to um fortune i'm talking money you're a magnet to fortune fame you're a magnet to riches to luxuries i'm talking about you just making an impact in life in general whatever situation you were brought here to do. And these people knew and they had, and they did not love you at all. They did all their intentions just to like, just to embody your energy, just to stifle your fortune. That way they can use, utilize you as a buffet. That is why they portrayed the sense as like love. If they ever showed that they cared, it was through material wealth because they can't embody real love or, em or empathetic love or, sensitive love sensitivity love because they don't hold those emotions so if you ever wonder why these people cannot give off love or empathy or the other emotions it is because they don't embody those themselves and they only did such things so that that way they can take from you they want to take your vital energy source and this is where your manifestation starts okay they wanted to use you as a, ma a manifestor generator that way they can stifle your fortune and they did you like they did you dirty and they did you so that way they can like pause your life like put you in like a cryogenic sense to keep you stagnant but you were like were the only one that did not have access because it was be drained from you you were in like a stagnant cryogenic state and think of it like this and these people you you weren't able to have access to it because they were like they think of it like this they had you frozen cryogenic right and they on the other side of it right they're um <clears throat> they're, they're they're draining you they're draining your source they're draining you at its core you feel me so and the thing is these people feel very ugly they they feel because they felt like they were so slick they were with you they thought they were so smart they thought they were so calculated but they like they they thought they had all the pieces to the puzzle together like they were doing something like they were achieving their goal i'm telling you right now they thought they were so slick they were so happy taken from you they thought that they could easily take from you what was designed to be you or like they were smarter than you mm -hmm. And you're just minding your own business. Like, like, because they thought that they could take, oh, man, like what was designed to be yours. You see what I'm saying? And they thought that they could just take it from right up under you with, uh, without your awareness, without your knowledge, awareness to the fact. But I'm telling you, it was not designed that way because it was not meant to be theirs. That's why, or any of the friends or anybody that was in their group. The small group or the larger group because 
pain. And now these people are paying. Like, these people are now paying massive debts. They're paying way more. And this is why you've been instructed by the Most High to, like, depart from these people. Like, leave them alone. I'm telling you right now. Because you are a protection of a sort. Like, leave these people alone. I'm telling you right now. Like, do not move with any... Do not go... I'm telling you, if you still live, and then leave. Uh, I'm getting... Get up and leave. Uproot and leave. If you're still around narcissistic... If you're dealing with uh, narcissistic family uh, members, get up and leave. I'm getting... Um, uh, take yourself, uproot yourself, and go. Like, you have to disconnect because they're about to be paying a massive debt heaps of debt is what they now owe and it's time to pay up so they're gonna have to be paying up now because they they did not know that what they were doing they would have to pay back they thought this is like one of those you know that loan that they give you that ppp loan where they give you 200 yes you have to pay it back unless you have a business you have to pay it back and they was not the business. I'm telling you guys right now, they did not, they was not a contender. They did not have a business in this sense. You feel me? Because the element that you have, that is the business. And they have been utilizing that, but they don't have the element. You see what I'm saying? Because your element attracts fortune. Because the thing is, they had your essence kind of like, and they were taking your vital. Like, so they could sustain whatever like, they were doing. So they actually, they needed you. They would have never been where you are, never where ever they've been to if they didn't have you in the, in the inclusion. So these people feel very shameful on the matter because they even, I'm telling you, they smell how they feel and they just look ugly to people because their energy is just so disgusted now. They let themselves go, like, because... They had their future, they had their plans, they had their identity hinging on being able to use you. They were energy harvest you, indefinitely. Everything was on the line of them using you. And now you've been like ripped away and they're clasped. I'm telling you, these people are looking like, smelling and feeling very, very ugly. Yeah. They feel robbed of something that should have been theirs. And it never was theirs, but they feel robbed of something that was yours. And it never was. So, and they, but these, I know, ironic, huh? Because the thing is, the level to egotistical that these people have is pretty much unbearable to think that they were entitled. All the pretending, all the lying, all the, if they said that they cared in any way, it was not. I'm telling you. There are people right now in your path, I'm telling you, that feel ugly, who are living. Because they're living a nightmare. They're wondering why, why things are looking up for you and why things are looking down for them. They're saying why, like, they, they're wondering why you are looking healthier, why you are rising like the phoenix, and why things are not going right in their lives every day. See? You see, not only was they taking your fortune, but they were dumping their problems on you. They were bypassing their issues on you. You have become a sponge for their problems. You were absorbing their pain, absorbing their, their damaged goods, and they were like sucking your essence, like sucking your good qualities, so that way they can go off and live their best life. You were like, they thought of you like their healer, whereas, they would just give you all their dump and their garbage and their problems and give you their illnesses, right? And then them, they'll go off and live like lavishly thinking it was all them and taking all the credit for it, thinking that they're entitled because that's what God has for them. No, that's not I'm telling you because these people did not give a crap. That was really happening. The level of, like, the level of injustice, of egotistical that these people, like, after you depart from these people, you will be feeling more justified in your life. Now that you are healing, now that you are fully healing, you will feel more justified. Like, if you were feeling any type of stuff before, now you're feeling much better. I'm telling you right now, all right? 